Hi, I just want to say that last poet's dress was really pretty. I'm Haley Green from Southeast. I'm a junior there. And as many of us have heard before, this poem is called, What Do You Want to Be When You Grow Up? What do you want to be when you grow up? I've heard this question time and time again. I've plotted my life out within composition books and taking classes that could never teach me the value of life itself, the way I could learn my living. I wanted to be a police officer a director, an actress, an author, a musician. I wanted to be so many things all at once that one day I wanted to be anything but myself. Anyone than who I was. And I guess somewhere in between fighting to live, I wanted to be loved. I wanted to feel like I was the center of the universe because in those moments of nothingness, I was nothing more than a relevant stardust in the midst of some forgotten galaxy at the edge of the universe. And when I got asked the question once again, what do you want to be when you grow up? All I could think about was being loved. The occupation never listed on a deed or job finder. The one that always finds its way into a desk at the corner of the office. The one that's neatly cluttered and typically you'll find it empty when you really need it. And too many times did I find that desk vacant. So now, you ask me, what do you want to be when you grow up? I'll laugh at the silence that follows, the tension that rises from the answer that could either go right or wrong, a word of encouragement or a lecture of failure. And I'll tell you, I'll tell you my life, I, didn't, I don't want it to be a pity party no longer, and that when I grow up, I want to be strong built by four vital pillars I can stand upon in the placements that I end in on a challenge. Mold my skin from silver and gold I melted from the metals I achieved. Touch the sky on these podiums and feel the way it kisses my cheeks with a motherly instinct. Put my heart on my shoulder for the first time since middle school and allow it to heal from all the times it was hurt and learn how to love the way it beats with an addictive cruelty. I'll hug my reflection with open arms and cradle the way my tears fall into my hands so I can let my strength shed through every weakness I have succumbed to, tear down my walls of fear every time I lift the bar at the gym, work until failure, work until I can be strong. And maybe one day I'll be strong enough to shelter my heart when it cannot function. Strong enough to keep pushing through everything I have failed to achieve until I can taste the sweet victory on my tongue, swallow it back like whiskey and savor the way it burns at a cost at the back of my throat. Strong enough to learn what's good and what's better for me as a person. For me to build a family I can truly be a part of. Strong enough to love someone I can lose in an instant and cherish the way his arms hold me better than I could ever hold myself. And in the dead of night, I will dream of the day that I will be strong. In the midst of planning my future, I wish that one day I will be strong enough. Because that's what I want to be when I grow up. Strong.